Question number one is identify the work below that does not belong to the literature of the 18th century. Here are the four options. The right answer is option number A. Advancement of learning. In this video, we will discuss only about the answers to reduce the length of the video. Okay, you can write all the options with their question in your copies if you want to. Question number two is which among the following is a place through which John Bunyan's Christian does not pass? The answer is option number B Mount Helicon. Number three is the period of Queen Victoria's reign is answer is option number B 1837 to 1901. Which of the following statements about the lyrical ballads is not true? Option A, B, C and D. The answer is option number D. It also printed from Grace Elegy written in a country churchyard. Okay. Now question number 5. One of the following texts was published earlier than 1955. Identify the text. The answer is option number C. William Epson collected poems. Okay. Now move to question number 6. Who among the poets in England during the 1930s had left leaning tendencies? The answer is option number C. W. H. Auden, Louis Magnus, Cecil Day Lewis. Now match the following. Look the question carefully, okay? Let me make it a little easier for you. The Sage of Concord. Dickinson, the nun of Amherst, Emerson, Mark Twain, Old Possium, Clements, Emily, R. W. T. S. Eliot, or Samuel. The answer is option number A. Okay. Now move to question number 8. Name the theorist who divided poets into strong and weak and popularized the practice of misreading. There are four options. The answer is option number B. Horald Bloom. Okay. Now, next is question number 9. In the rape of the lock, Pope repeatedly compares Belinda to? Answer is option number A. The sun. Next. Which of the following awards is not given to Indian English writers? The answer is option number C. The Gyan Pit. Okay. Next. Identify the correct statement below. Option number B. Gorbudak is a tragedy, while Ralph Reister, Doister, and Grammar Gurton's Needle are comedies. Okay. Next. Number 12. W.M. Thakre's Vanity Fair owes its title to. Answer is option number D. Bunyan's Pilgrim's Progress. Next one, number 13. The Puritans shut down all theatres in England in? Answer is option number A. 1642. Who of the following was not a contemporary of Walsworth and Coleridge? The answer is... Option number D. A.C. Swinburne. Okay. Now move to number 15. Which of the following statements about waiting for Godot is not true? The answer is. Option number D. Okay. Number 1. It carries a subtitle. A tragic comedy in two acts. Now number 16. The Bloomsbury group included British intellectuals, critics, writers and artists. Who among the following belonged to the Bloomsbury group? The answer is option number A means 1 and 2. That means John Maynard Keynes, Lytton Strache, E.M. Foster, Roger Fry, Clive Bell. Number 17. Who among the following is credited with the making of the first authoritative dictionary of the English language? The answer is option number B. Samuel Johnson. Very important question. 
Now move to number 18. In Dryden's essay of dramatic poesy, who opens the discussion on behalf of the ancients? The answer is option number B. Critis. Now number 19. The term invective refers to? The answer is option number A. That is the abusive writing of speech in which there is harsh denunciation of some person or thing okay now move to number 20 which of the following novels depicts the plight of the Bangladeshi immigrants in East London the answer is number D Brick Lane okay now number 21 the year 1939 proved to be a crucial year for two important writers in England identify the correct phrase below the answer is option number A for its who died for Auden who left England for the US next one number 22 the enlightenment was characterized by then the answer is option number B a belief in the universal authority of reason and emphasize on scientific experimentation now question number 23 which Shakespearean play contains the line there is a special province in the fall of a sparrow the answer is option number B Hamlet okay now number 25 match the following pairs of books and authors look at the options move to the correct answer the correct answer is option number answer number B okay now number 25 in which of the following texts do Aston Davis and Mick appear as characters answer is option number B Harold Pinter's caretaker now number 26 what is common to the following writers identify the correct description below the name of the writers are William Congreve George Etheridge William Wackerley or Thomas Otway okay look at the options the correct answer is option number A all of these were restoration playwrights now number 27 in which Jane Austen novel do you find the characters Annie Elliot Lady Russell Louisa Musgrove and Captain Wentworth the answer is option number C persuasion now number 28 in which of this in which of his essays does Homi Bhava discuss the discovery of English in colonial India the answer is option number A signs taken from wonders now number 29 dash was the first sonnet sequence in English look at the options the answer is option number A Edmund Spencer's Amority now number 30 which is the correct sequence of the novels of VS Nepal look at the options closely the answer is number D the mystic measure the suffrage of Elvira Miguel Street a house of mr. A house for mr. Biswas okay now number 31 Kubla Khan takes an epigram from the answer is option number a Samuel purchase purchase house number 32 which of the following author theme is correctly matched look at the options answer is option number a okay that means the battle of the books tribute to the root forefathers of the hamlet next one which among the following titles set occurs a course for academic literary feminism the answer is option number c a room of one's own next one in which play do we see a reworking of e m foster's a passage to india as a cameo the answer is option number c indian ink next number 35 shakespeare's sonnets answer is number d are dedicated to an unknown mr w h william herbert now number 36 is which of the following poems uses terzarima or terzarima the answer is option number b pb shell is ode to the west wind 
नेक्स्ट वन थर्टी सेवन वेन वन से इज दैट साम वन इज नो मोर और दैट साम वन हैज ब्रीथेड हिज हार लास्ट द स्पीकर इज रेस्टोरिंग टू डी यू फेनिमिजम और यू फेमिजम नंबर थर्ड इयर हुई ऑफ द फॉलोइंग आर कॉम्पेनियन पोएम्स द आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर बी लालगिरो एंड द सेकेंड पेंसिलोसो नंबर थर्टी नाइन व्हाट डज द टर्म एपिस्टीम सिग्निफाई द आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर ए नॉलेज नो नंबर फोर्टी हुई ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज अ बेटर डेफिनेशन ऑफ एन इमेज इन लिटरेरी राइटिंग द आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर बी अ स्पीकिंग पिक्चर नेक्स्ट वन होम डेट किड्स रिगार्ड एज द प्राइम एग्जाम्पल ऑफ नेगेटिव कैपाबिलिटी आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर सी विलियम शेक्सपियर नेक्स्ट वन चार्ल्स डिकेन्स अ टेल ऑफ टू सिटीज बिगिन्स विद द सेंटेंस ऑप्शन नंबर ए इट वॉज द बेस्ट ऑफ टाइम्स इट वॉज बिट वॉज द सैडेस्ट ऑफ टाइम्स नाउ नंबर फोर्टी थ्री द वर्कस ऑफ जेरल्ड मैनले हॉपकिस वर पब्लिश्ड पोस्थोमसली बाय नंबर सी रॉबर्ट ब्रिजेस नाउ नंबर फोर्टी फोर हुई ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज द करेक्ट क्रोनोलॉजिकल सिक्वेंस एंसर इज नंबर बी द डिजार्टेड भिलेज अ पॉइजन ट्री ओजिमेंट्रियस द ब्लेस्ड डैमजोल नंबर फोर्टी फाइव द टर्म होमोलॉजी मीन्स अ कोरेस्पॉन्डेंस बिटवीन टू और मोर स्ट्रक्चर्स हु ऑफ द फॉलोइंग डेवलप्ड अ थियोरी ऑफ रिलेशंस बिटवीन लिटररी वर्कस एंड सोशल क्लासेस इन टर्म्स ऑफ होमोलॉजीज द करेक्ट एंसर इज रेमंड विलियम्स नो नंबर फोर्टी सिक्स एफ टर्नर्स फेमस हाइपोथिसिस इज दैट द ऑप्शन इज आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर सी द फ्रंटायर हैज बीन द वन ग्रेट डिटार्मिनेंट ऑफ अमेरिकन सिविलाइजेशन नंबर फोर्टी सेवन हुई स्टेटमेंट्स बिलो ऑन द स्पेंसरियन स्टैंडा इज और आर एक्यूरेट द करेक्ट आंसर इज नंबर डी दैट मीन्स नंबर फोर एंड एट Line stanza with six use of figurative language, iambic feet followed by a nine in iambic pentameter. Now question number forty-eight. Match the following texts with their respective themes. Look at the options. The correct answer is option number B. Okay. Now move to second last question of this set. The preliminary version of James Joyce. portrait of the artist as a young man was called option number a stephen hero now last question number 50 a passage is a mixture of themes stylistic elements of subjects borrowed from their works answer is option number a okay to get more informative videos like this please subscribe our channel and like comment and share and connected with us thank you